In this video, I will show you how to download the Microsoft Authenticator app on your Apple iPhone. To begin installation, scan the QR code underneath iOS on your screen right now, or you can go to the website that's listed on the screen. This will bring up the additional security verification page. In step one, when it asks, how shall we contact you? Click the drop-down and select mobile app. When it asks, how do you want to use the mobile app? Select receive notifications for verification and then click on setup. Directions for installing your mobile app on your device will pop up on the screen. We will have to move over to our devices now, but we want to make sure that we keep this window pulled up on our computer. Do not close this window right now. Let's move over to our cell phone. On your mobile device, you wanna to navigate to your app store. Click on it, and in your search box, you're gonna type in Microsoft Authenticator. Scroll down until you see this symbol, and then we're going to install that app. Once it is installed, we're going to click on open. Agree to any permissions. And then sign in with Microsoft by adding a work or school account. To authenticate your email address, we're going to hit the plus button in the top right corner. Then we're going to click on work or school account. From this screen, we're going to click on scan QR code. From here, we will take our device and go and scan the QR code that is on our computers by hovering over that screen. We will click on our email address. And it will give us a one-time password code. This code will refresh every 30 seconds. Now we're going to move back to our computer. Then we're going to click on next. Secure your account. We're going to make sure that we can reach on your mobile app device. So go back to your app. On the app, it's going to ask you if you want to approve sign in. Click approve. Back to your computer, it should tell you that your verification was successful and bring you to step three. In step three, you want to make sure that you enter in your mobile device's phone number. This is in case you lose access to the mobile app. So enter your cell phone number here. And then click done. Once you've done that, you are all signed in. Go ahead and click on yes or no to reduce the number of times that you are asked to sign in. Once you click done, you are done with your authentication app. If any further assistance is needed, please enter a help desk ticket at helpdesk.ebrschools.org. A DTS team member will contact you on the phone number that you entered in your help desk ticket. Hope this helps.